That's right, Bob. If some of you are tuning in right now, you are seeing a world record set by the Guinness World Record Foundation for the largest gathering of losers in the United States and maybe even the world's history. Let's check in on the uh, progress now as uh, more and more losers gather amongst the state's capital, Bob. You can see them waving their loser flags as well, and as you can, you can differentiate most of them from normal people because they're not wearing masks. Most likely believing that whatever this disease is that's out there is uh, probably a hoax. Oh, oh, we're getting word right now, Bob, that we're going in and uh, I believe we're going to be talking with one of our correspondents on the scene. Let's just give it one second to load in here for one moment. We're going to be talking to Dave on scene. That's right, Bob, I'm Dave. I'm here on scene and uh, trying to talk with some of the protesters. So, oh, we're not calling them protesters. We'll, we'll call them mobsters. Uh, insurrect, insurrectors, then. How about that, Bob? Uh, yes, most of them have gathered uh, amongst the state capitol here. Uh, you know, soon late to be arrested. But uh, as much as they can gather right now, why why the fuck not, you know? It's the uh, the end of the administration, and it's probably a good place to cry together, you know? So I'm going to go in and interview a couple more of them and uh, we're going to give a, oh, we, looks like we've lost, uh, looks like we've lost our video connection there. I guess we're going to have a moment of sadness for President Trump.